Hi, I'm Randy Jeffers, and uh, you, you may have heard that uh, Sir Edmund Hillary was the first man to ever climb Mount Everest. Now, this happened uh, about a month after I was born, and it's back in, uh, in 1953, and he scaled the highest mountain then known to man. It was, it's supposed to be something like 29,000 feet straight up, and, and uh, you know, he, he got knighted for his efforts, became a Sir. And he made a lot of people uh, happy and got on the speaking uh, circuit and, and told the story to many people. Uh, you know, he, I think he even made an American Express card commercial because of it. But, you know, if you read his book, it's called High Adventure. You know, and unless you read that, you're not going to really understand that, uh, uh, you know, all the things that it took for him to accomplish this incredible feat. Uh, you see, in, in 1952, one year before, he attempted to make the climb, but he had this incredible fa failure. And, uh, you know, everybody thought it was a pretty cool thing, and so, you know, they wanted him to tell the story because he, he almost made it, but he didn't quite make it. And uh, so uh, there was a, uh, a group in England that, that asked him to, uh, to address its members, and so he walked on stage, and of course they gave him a standing ovation for his, uh, his attempt, and, and uh, you know, they were recognizing that, that there really was an attempt at greatness. But Edmund Hillary didn't see that. He saw it as a failure. And so he moved away from the microphone, he walked over the edge of the platform, he made a fist, and he pointed at a, at a picture of the mountain and he said in this really loud voice, he says, Mount Everest, you beat me the first time, but I'm going to beat you because you've grown all you can grow and I'm still growing and he went on to accomplish it the following year. Here's to your absolutely incredible success.